Hey Pisces, thank you for checking out my channel for the love of water tarot. It's your girl Keonti and I'm going to bring us a love reading, general reading to see what's going on in the life of Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you're cross-watching for the baby sharks, it could definitely resonate from your perspective, but it is a general read. Every message won't resonate for every Pisces on the planet. If I get it right for you guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you're interested in booking me for a private reading, my email information will be provided in the description box below. Mercury Retrograde got to me i wanted to premiere the dirty little secret video but i wasn't able to do it the way i wanted to i hope you guys enjoyed it if you watched it check it out i'm going to start off with doing the recent past so i can find out what's coming in the future what's going on in our life in the recent past so let's go let's get some messages for pisces the baby sharks okay courtship okay so i definitely have an energy with you and the soulmate theft a stolen moment some of you could have recently decided that a situation with a soulmate was a waste of time. Or some of you feel like your soulmate is wasting your time. They stole your heart or something like this. Because the theft is an energy of a loss, right? <clears throat> I do have a courtship here, but there, in, in the recent past, there was some sort of energy of loss in this situation, right? Whether it's you feeling this way or they feeling this way, right? Give me one for Pisces for the recent past. What went down with Pisces for the recent past, spirit? Message of concern gift pisces i feel like in this courtship in this situation whatever this soulmate connection was in this situation here i felt like it had it, there was a lot of potential with the gift but i feel like the message of concern was um the message of concern is simply like is this gonna be a waste of time or is this gonna be the gift that keeps on giving here right <clears throat> for sure I definitely feel like someone who you ended it with, who you saw as a waste of time, could have recently reached out wanting to make some sort of offer to you, right? Give me some more for the recent past. Some of you, I see that. Someone that you ended something with, you saw as a waste of time, they could have recently reached out to want to offer you something. I see you kind of side-eyeing that offer, though, Pisces. Let's see. Give me some more. <laughs> Give me some more for the baby sharks. Change. Mature man. See, if you're side-eyeing an offer, Pisces, because you could feel like you definitely have moved on, right you could be wondering if someone has changed i have this mature man here that could definitely be a message of concern coming from him you could be a man watching this and you could have this you could be looking at this message like this right i feel like someone's looking at looking at the message of concern because they're um concerned if things are going to change or not right you could be dealing with the cancerian here's a mature man i feel like there's a there's a concern if something will change in the past here this is the recent past there was a concern to see if things are going to move forward, if something was going to change, maybe if someone was going to move here. Give me more for the recent past for Pisces. Give me more for the recent past for Pisces. For sure. Oh, wealthy man. So I have Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy. Doesn't have to be thought. So Pisces in the past... <clears throat> I feel like this wealthy man, you, whether you're him or you, this is about him, I feel like this wealthy man has some decisions to make, right? This is him thinking, right? The message of concern is about this change. Is something going to move forward? Are we going to get this car? Whatever this is, right? Are you going to move? Have you changed, right? <laughs> for sure. Some of that. Give me some more on this for the recent past. So we're going to do a little clarification and I'm going to get some future energies for us. Give me some for the recent past here for Pisces. You could be a man watching this and you could be concerned about coming to your girl or her coming to you, right? Yeah, distant horizons. Yeah, setting free and there's a mature woman. Imprisonment. Yeah, so Pisces, it's looking to me like in the past, I do have masculine and feminine energy here, right? I feel like there's a real reservation here. There's reservations about, I don't feel like there's reservations about the soulmate connection, right? I do feel like there's clear that there's a connection here. Courtship, right? But when theft was underneath the deck, I told you that's like a loss. So there's an energy of someone being concerned. Is something going to be a loss? Is something going to be a waste of time? Will something change? For some of you, this has something to do with physical movement here, right? For some of you, this is something like someone could be very stubborn and weighed down by their job and their career. Are they going to like free themselves so they can pursue here, right? Someone could literally be needing to move, right? Because I feel like, and I, I don't feel like it's the feminine energy that's anchored down. I feel like it's the masculine energy that's anchored down here. I feel like there's a courtship energy here. There's definitely here about a soulmate connection, but there's definitely concern about this change, right? Is someone going to finally get out of their way or stop self-sabotaging or like get out of a situation that they're anchored and tied down to? 
right? Or are they gonna stay trapped, right? You ride, you are you riding now? Let me get a little clarification on this recent past here. Give me one for the courtship for Pisces. Give me one for the courtship. Page of Swords. See, I feel like you both, the world. I feel like in the past, you both looked at each other in kind of the same energy, right? You both were checking each other out. This could literally be about distance with the world, cycles closing out, lessons learned. There's something about some online people. Some of you definitely got somebody watching you online, a soulmate. They keep an AI out for you for sure. I do feel like distance is a factor in this situation. But look, Pisces, here we go, the Queen of Cups and the Ace of Wands. So I feel like there's no lack of attraction here. Yeah, the lovers, oh, there's no lack of attraction. The two of swords are there, but there's something about a decision that needs to be made. Give me one on a message of concern and change. I feel like however this is going, how this went in the past, this was the concern. Is something going to change? Is something going to move forward? Are you going to move? Are we going to get a car? Are we going to, whatever this is, right? Definitely be dealing with the can't see me. Look, four of swords. See, there's somebody just thinking about something, right? Eight of swords, right? This is like, is someone going to finally get like get out of this Eight of Swords energy, drop this anchor, this burden, whatever this is, and is this going to move forward? Yeah, Ace of Pentacles to a new beginning, Pisces. Yes, I see what the issue is here. I see what the issue is in the past, for sure. I'm going to get one more for the distant horizons. It's, there's a separation between a man and a woman. And what's happening here is, is someone has to, fit, ha has to make this decision, right? Is something going to change? Is someone going to like, I don't know what the imprisonment energy is. It's the same energy as this distant horizon. It's something that's keeping somebody anchored and weighed down. For some of you, this is career shit. I see that. There could be family issues. I'm just, it doesn't, the cards are not, are very nondescript, but I feel like you and someone both see this courtship between the two of each other, but I see the issue. So let me get one. Between this minute, there's a distance between masculine and feminine energy here. And somebody got somebody gonna have to do something. The devil, you could be dealing with a Capricorn, but what did I tell you? Look, Pisces, here you go, the Queen of Cups. Pisces, like I said, what happened in the past and what this is all about is the devil is that imprisonment energy, feeling extremely trapped, extremely binded, restrictive. Someone could definitely be like literally in prison, right? Someone could be in a legal binding contract, right? Someone could literally be like have like stuck career-wise, right, with the devil, whatever this is, I see what the past problem was or what the, what just happened in the recent past with this whole thing here, right, because there's potential. Under imprisonment is sudden woke. There's potential. Some of you are just dealing with an extreme paper chaser, bad health. This person is really, really chasing money and career right now, right, married to the money. For some of you, that is it. For some of you, could literally be somebody like literally in jail. Whatever's keeping this separation here, what's under the Queen of Cups, the Ace of Wands. There's no lack of attraction for you and somebody, Pisces. I see what the recent past was. Let's go ahead and get some for the future energy for the baby shark spirit. Make it plain for me. What's coming towards? What, what, what's headed? Where is this headed for the baby sharks? Give me some, give me some real clear messages. Let me help my soul drive out. Where is this headed for the Pisces? What's the future holding for this for the Pisces? I see the inner, I see the problem, Pisces. It's gonna be different for all of you, but it is something that's weighing somebody down heavily. It needs to be a burden that someone needs to drop. They're feeling very anchored down to it, and they need to get out of it in order for you guys to have this toil and labor. So there is getting ready to be some work put in sudden woke. See, like I said, some of you, someone is like extremely paper chasing here. They're trying to get their money together, right? In order to be able to come. And, and make this change or travel or whatever the fuck it is to close this distance here. I see in the future that's getting ready to be real energy and effort. And to get in the bag here. Give me some more. Give me some more for the future energy for Pisces. Where is this headed? What's the near future? We don't want far away future. We want near future. <laughs> what's the near future for my baby sharks for this situation? So clear. I see what's happening. I just... Yeah, maybe something for the future energy. Sudden woke. Yeah, so somebody, listen, there's a, there's definitely an energy into having something here. Community. Yeah, I definitely feel like there, there's definitely an energy and effort. Like, I don't know, I feel like somebody is working with a lot of people or somebody does a lot of work in the community or work outside. Some of you, you could be dealing with somebody who literally... Like, I don't know why I'm getting, like, like a, like a star energy. Somebody who does, like, somebody who's, like, a celebrity. 
right? And they get around a lot. I don't mean like get around a lot, but like, yeah, I don't know. I'm just getting like somebody working with a lot of people here, right? Business. It feels very businessy for somebody. Somebody works with like a whole bunch of business communities and stuff like that. This could literally be that energy. Like this person works their ass off. I told you. Give me some more for the future energy for Pisces. Give me some more of the future energy for Pisces. Bad hope. Some of you are dealing with a workaholic for sure. Official person. Okay. Well, I'm just going to call it how I see it. Somebody could be in a bad situation. They could say, there could be a whole nother relationship somewhere else with the devil. If you know, you know, you know. If someone's in another relationship here, they're not happy in that other relationship. That's not for everybody. That is not for everybody. Right? Somebody could be definitely away taking care of a sick person here, for sure. Someone could be away taking away taking care of a sick person. That could be what's keep holding them back, right? For sure. Someone could definitely take care of family and sick people or something. Some of you could be there. That you, some of you could be dealing with an official healer here, right? This could be like a doctor, right? I don't know why I just heard like a physical therapist or like a professional. Somebody could work with like athletes and. That's not for everybody. Somebody could definitely work with like athletes, healing athletes or something here. I don't know why I'm getting that. But I feel like what's happening here in the future is somebody's putting a lot of energy and effort. I feel like this official person is taking control, but this person could be overworking here to get some money and get some abundance. Like if this is just your person, you could miss the hell out of them. But this person is working real hard to go get, get the coin. I see that. Give me some more for the future energy for Pisces. Give me more for the future energy for Pisces. Give me more for the future energy. Divine Feminine. What's going on with her? Sudden Wealth. Yeah. Feminine energy. There's getting ready to be an energy of you hitting a jackpot in some sort of way. I do feel like there could be a man... That wants to really offer this woman something here, right? I don't know. I'm not sure the bad hope feels sort of, sort of like this devil energy, whatever this person is taking care of. That may be keeping them stuck, tied up, stuck. It doesn't have to be nefarious for all of you. For some of you, it is. But you just put yourself where you go, right? There's something coming to this divine feminine. Sudden wealth. There's something suddenly happening. Some lucky shit. Give me some more. For the Pisces, for the future energy here. For the Pisces. Give me more for the future energy for Pisces. Near future. Very near future. Where is this headed for the baby sharks? Ooh, a couple. Look, look, Pisces. They, they next to each other. Main male and main female. This is a couple. Look, high honor. Recognition. Acknowledgement. Child. There's going to be a new beginning here. I do feel like this man may want to really show this woman some high honor, some recognition. May really want to have a new beginning here. Yep. Marriage, the lovers, message of concern. Yeah, I do feel like somebody wants to have a new beginning. They want to cuddle up, huddle up. Some of y'all, this is somebody you have a child with. Children could be involved in a situation. It could literally be something about a marriage and children and other another lover. If you know, you know, because I see some of that under the deck too. But I see a couple. I see two people here who honor, acknowledge, respect each other. Yeah. I see two people get on the same page, kind of acknowledging this is like a high, a high level of respect between two people here, for sure. Mm, Pisces, let's get some clarification on this. If I got it right for you, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you're interested in booking me, please email. Let's see what the toil and labor is here for the future energy. Pisces, this is a lot of work getting ready. Someone's getting ready to put in some work here. They finna get ready to put in the hours, the work, whatever this is. The Knight of Wands. See, so I feel like somebody moves around a lot. I don't mean to say like get around a lot, but somebody works a lot. They move around a lot. They can have a lot on their plate. This could be somebody who doesn't have a lot of time. But look, Ace of Wands. For some of you, this is sexual. Somebody definitely getting ready to come in and put in that work. You could be dealing with a fire sign. For some of you, that, that, that this is the literal energy of I'm ready to put in that work. Put it where it goes, Pisces. I see it. Mm-hmm. Like I said, but this person may work a lot. This person may have a lot of responsibilities. It could be a Leo, the sun. But this is getting ready to be some happy shit coming in. And there's a king of swords here with the moon. There's a masculine energy here. I feel like the moon is under him because there's still some things hidden about what he's doing. He could be signing documents. He may have something to say that he has not said yet. Strength. Ooh, wee. Let's see what the sun wealth is about for the future energy for Pisces. What's the future energy? What's the sun wealth about? 
the Hierophant, see? The Eight of Wands. I feel like there's definitely energy. You could be dealing with a Taurus. There's something about career taking off, money taking off. Somebody could run a lot of businesses and shit like that here, right? Or like, like I said, some of you are dealing with somebody who deals with famous people or is a famous person themselves. They work a lot. They get around a lot. They may get a lot of adoration. But look at that Eight of Wands. Somebody is really focused on getting their money right for sure. As far as career, no doubt about it. And I feel like they're, they're going to be successful. Somebody could be working on getting their way out of a relationship, I got to tell you. If somebody got tricked into a relationship for children and money, they could notice somebody only wants them for money. They could be trying to get out of that. Why is bad health here? Six of Pentacles. Yeah, because I feel like that, that flew right out. The Six of Wands. Yeah, someone is telling me that this bad health energy here, This someone is balancing this out, right? Like, like I said, some of you are dealing with a healer or someone who heals sick people here. I know it. They balance them out. They get them well. They get them back on their feet. But there's definitely an energy here of I'm just trying to balance this out. Six of Wands. Yep. Get this victory and success, right? If you guys are in separation because this person moves around a lot and work a lot, they like, baby, I'm just trying to get this together. Six of Wands. Yeah. I'm just trying to get this success. This success. Yep, it's something about somebody sticking to their guns because they 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 um they standing their ground in terms of money. They tempering themselves because they are coming back to this empress. She may be stressed, but he may be stressed about it. Give me something for the main female here. That's this empress. It's divine feminine energy. The eight of cups, the six of swords, divine feminine. Whew. Couple things. This person could definitely be leaving someone, right? The the empress, the the, the divine feminine, eight of cups, six of swords. This could be somebody leaving that energy. But if I, but, but, but feminine energy here, it feels like you're giving up. Six of swords, five of pentacles, knight of pentacles, knight of swords. Why do I feel like this person may feel like you're giving up or walking away or turning your back on them and moving on? Maybe you gave this person an ultimatum. Give me one more for the main female. Give me one more. Four cups. It's saying... The star. Yeah. Listen. If 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 you gave this person an ultimatum recently or you rejected this person, they do want to come back and make up with you. Some of you I feel like you feel like um like I said, some of you are dealing with like a literal star or a famous or popular person. And you like fuck it. I'm le I'm 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 straight. Yep, they coming back. King of Wands, Ten of Wands, I just feel like this person just got a lot on their plate. And I feel like you turning your back on it and you feeling rejected because this person got all this stuff going on on their on plate. But this person adores this woman. He coming back, King of Wands, Ten of Wands, Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, whatever he taking care of, he coming back. Why is the main male here? I do. I'm feminine energy. I don't know why I feel like you feel like this person is rejecting you, but they not. I'm telling Why is main male here? Why is main male for the Pisces? Wow. You you get you giving up because you feel like it's a waste of time or this person is rejecting you. Judgment. See, he want another chance. The King of Pentacles. I'm telling you, something dealing with money. Two of Cups still still got the soulmate connection with this woman. The Chariot coming to her. Yep. Nine of Swords. Stress the fuck out. There's something about relieving some sort of stress, headaches, anxiety. Yep. It's coming straight to the Empress. What I tell you. Give me one more on this main man. He could be having to make some real business decisions and stuff dealing with contracts and stuff like that too. Give me some for main mail here. Give me one more. See? It's the, look, they, they 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 say what they say. The Emperor. Aries Taurus energy. I got Scorpio energy and Ten of Cups. He is making some sort of decision. Yep, he gonna he gonna make some sort of decision that's gonna make a feminine energy happy. Even though she is very guarded, he still wanted. He ready to work on it. He got a new idea here. I got an idea. <laughs> Give me one for high honor. I feel like this is like a mutual agreement because there's like mutual respect for each other. I feel like he wants to give this woman some sort of recognition here for pentacles holding it, holding back king of cups. This is somebody who holds back their emotions, but this could also be somebody just holding, just having to hold on to money, doing shit, dealing with money right now. But here's a king of cups. Look, two of swords, see? It's something that the feminine energy don't know here. See, Queen of Swords, Six of Cups. See, this man, either he dealing with something, dealing with money, right? He having to hold back his money. I feel like he's holding something back that he has for this feminine energy. King of Cups, Two of Swords. The feminine energy doesn't see this. She's sitting here as this Queen of Swords, Six of Cups. Like, well, I loved you. You didn't love me. Three of Swords, you hurt me. Yeah, but Temperance, he wants to heal this with this Empress. He wants to come right towards her. I'm trying to tell you. Give me some more for this, Hayana. 
watching the Four of Pentacles here. Like I said, someone could definitely be in another situation that they got to get out of. And if you know, you know, you know, this person could definitely be having to balance things out with money. Get money right before they can get out of it. Ten of Pentacles, four, Six of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, right? And then here's the Seven of Pentacles. There's something about a delay dealing with money and finances. But look at that. That Ace of Wands is coming in. Yep, the Moon. Pisces, there's something very mysterious about this. Pisces, either you are stuck in your head and you can't figure this out or there's something mysterious about it that you don't see coming. But I see a King of Swords here and there is some sort of ending. I feel like he's making some sort of decision here to get to, to bring some sort of ending here. I feel like this dude here is getting ready to do something that's going to surprise someone. It's like this acknowledgement, high honor. It's like someone wants someone to know that they do think highly of them, regardless to what all this him and Han shit's been about. Someone does think highly of someone here that thinks that they doesn't, that is giving up and probably rejecting this shit. Someone's getting ready to come in and make an offer. It's completely mysterious. Either you don't see it coming or you trapped in your head about it, Pisces. But I do see that Ace of Wands coming in this situation. I love you, baby sharks. If I got it right for you, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. If you're interested in booking me, please email me. I appreciate all y'all continued support. I appreciate all the subscribers, old and new. Y'all make my day. Y'all look how the sun just came over here. Let me get out of here. Bye, Pisces.